I'm Ed Bacon, the author of Eight Habits of Love, Open Your Mind, Open Your Heart. The roadmap of Eight Habits of Love begins with generosity, allowing what comes into you to flow out. It's really a book about affluent spirituality to allow yourself to understand a different meaning of the word affluence. Then it moves uh, from generosity to talking about stillness. I chose stillness because I wanted to appeal to a wide readership. Stillness has to do with finding that place inside you where you, aware, you are aware of how deeply you're loved and everyone else is loved. Uh, the book moves on to truth about being led from a rather constrictive worldview and story about the way the world works to a more expansive and more expansive truth about the way the world works. It goes from truth to candor, which has to do with being frank with someone else in the service of having a deeper, more durable friendship, of being able to tell someone how their behavior has impacted you and to provide a time for them to tell you how your behavior has impacted them. Then it goes into forgiveness, the power of being able to emancipate yourself from old grudges and resentments to compassion, the ability to see the loveliness in every human being and to believe that everyone can rediscover that loveliness. It moves to play, the ability to relax and not be so uptight, not to take oneself so seriously. And there's a brain science that flows through the book all the way that says that when you're playful, rather than being uptight, you become more like other mammals and like other primates. You can think, you can have compassion, you can care for your young, and you can create and innovate. And then community is the last chapter, the last habit, and that is understanding that none of us can be human alone, none of us can be free alone, none of us can love alone. If we're afraid, that makes us isolate ourselves. But when we emancipate ourselves, when we emancipate ourselves from fear, we can be a part of the human family. I want to provide people a sense of confidence and hope and expectation that they literally, if they follow this roadmap, can live a life of freedom and love and transformative power.